Hi folks, welcome back. I had an inspiration today to go back and try the uh, magnesium. Look, I just laid this on the same piece of paper as that. They're not touching just the water that's in this piece of uh, paper towel here from a previous experiment I did. Look at the voltage we got. <laughs> and they're not even touching. So there is one source of possible uh, error right there, isn't it? Look at there. And they're not even touching each other. But I think that's pretty amazing. I mean, that's just laying on that. And we've got current, or we've got the current potential anyway, right there between those. Look, I'll lift it back up. Drops to zero, or nearly zero. 0.03, and pick my fingers off of it. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Just by touching the thing, and I'm not even hitting that water there. So, but look, look at there. And it's interesting too that it'll climb. It climbs real high, and then and then it'll start dropping off again. See? And we see that same behavior when we've been making the cells. And it may have been caused by the damn water on there. And the intuition leads me to all kinds of shit, I'm telling you. See, I would have I would have never known that, but I followed that hunch to go try the magnesium and I just accidentally laid it down right there as I was setting up and I discovered something new. Really amazing. Synchronicity in the universe. Okay. Um, well, I just had to share that because it's important and uh, it's something we can all take advantage of. It's good to uh, follow your intellectual curiosity, but it's also good to, to follow your uh, right brain intuition. Uh, the unconscious mind has access to all knowledge and it's not limited by time and space and it will lead you to what you need to know and experience to expand your consciousness and uh, all you have to do is and uh, willing to listen to it uh, follow instructions I hope you found this uh, enjoyable and informative thanks for watching I'll see you next time